I'm 25 days to my birthday. I know. <laughs> Friday is my 25th birthday and um, I'm vlogging 24 days to my 24th birthday like candy vlogs of my life like I literally whip up my camera anytime anywhere anyhow to give you guys like exclusive tips into my life 24 days before my 24th birthday I'm, I'm a little bit excited I like the fact I'm leaving 23 it was like safe for me, but anyway, man has to grow anyway. So yeah, twenty fourth is twenty fourth. So my birthday is on the eleventh of January, and today is the eighteenth of no nineteenth of December. That's twenty four days to January eleventh. So that's now. I'm actually gonna clean up my room because I'm allergic to dust, so tend to have to sit doing a lot. But um, you need to send me more. You know, you will miss it tomorrow. You need to get everything, like everything. You can't just get it, me looking like raw sauce, and then miss me looking like ketchup. You need to get everything, okay? So I'm gonna start um cleaning my room. Coffee thought I should um rearrange my room, and I'm gonna try that this morning because I'm not. Going into school till 9 a.m. So, yeah, I'm gonna try this morning whilst listening to my lecture as background music. So, we thought the room was a bit clustered. Well, he thought, I just thought, well, I was using space, but apparently, he thinks the room's a bit clustered. So, we're gonna like clean it out and um, look at the bed, wearing stuff. It shouldn't take more than 30 minutes, hopefully, because that's how long the recording is for, and then... more spacious without even like putting things in place like the room is a lot a lot a lot more spacious like uh, coffee i will not let you know you're right till you walk in here yourself like this is different like wow wow that's what i can say wow let's finish like now Can you imagine? See all this space. Like, see all this space I have been like joking around with. Like, I can't even believe to say thank you. Okay, thank you so much. Like, my room is looking bigger. It looks very revamped. Like, hello. Yeah, with my chicken legs. Anyways, uh -huh. yeah. I'm gonna shower now and have breakfast.
day two, kind of 23 days to 24. Yes, I'm moving out. I'm having a very early class this morning. I'm having um, a 7.30 a.m. lecture. And um, it is 7 or 6 at the moment. I'm having a very quick breakfast. Yes, I'm ready for tea. Yes, and I'm done in an, um, uh, a pink sweater with um, this gray and greenish skirt, which I think I love. I love it a lot. Yes, yeah, so basically, I am going to have breakfast. So, <clears throat> I'm done. I'm done. For class right now it's seven seventeen, so I have about twelve minutes to get to class. Yeah. Back from lectures, yeah, my fan is really making noise because I think I cranked it up to the highest, but I'm back from lectures, like, it ended like a long time ago, but I stayed back to study a little bit, but I'm feeling a little bit weird, so I came home and um, I'll try to sort myself out, like, take my own history and see what's up with me, then I'll have lunch. Maybe study a bit, see one or a movie or something, and then yeah. I want to do some cleaning also in my house. I know I'm cleaning again. Yes, I really do like dust, and I spotted some dust on my fan, so yes. I like to clean the dust out. Yes. So, aside that, how are you guys doing? It's day 23, and I'm trying to find reason for every day i'm trying to um find to learn something every day of the 24 day journey and yesterday i i learned really i can do what i put my mind to like it was so good okay so i was on the ward and i wasn't without my ward quotes and i had taken off my name tag i quickly wanted to check something on my with my patient right and then there was this other patient there was this other patient who was complaining of um, abdominal pain and was in serious pain. And then one of the student nurses was like, I was standing there with my colleagues, I was discussing. And then she came, she tapped me, she's like, doctor, doctor, please can you help us see the patient? The patient's complaining of abdominal pain. And I'm like, okay, so first off, I'm just my first year of clinicals. So like, I'm not exactly the person to call because I'm like, bottom of the chain right now which and I'm like oh you know I'm not the doctor on call right she goes oh I'm a student she goes ah and I'm like okay cool I can just get you a doctor you know what let me get you a doctor because anyways I want to attend to my patient and I want to ask a few questions about my patient as well so I just get you a doctor to look at the the guy and then I mean to like okay all right and i'm like you see i looked the part already um hi like hello i looked the part already you know what i'm saying but yeah it was it was really good it was it was a good feeling and um i kind of got pushed like i'm gonna make it i know i'll make it but i don't just want to make it right now like gonna make it well excellent in the world i want to be an excellent doctor like yeah so like i'm just like touched so that's my sub story from yesterday today really i'm trying to do a lot of staying alone trying to you know look inside and um see what i have gained or what i have learned for today so yeah it's like 24 days to self-discovery and i hope to be a very renewed better person when i'm you know when i turn 24 i don't just want to turn age and turn up i want to turn age and you know, turn my bank figures 
bank statement figures around, turn my personal, personality around in the right places, turn around my friends, turn around my way of life. You know, turn, I want positive changes. I don't just want to grow. I want positive growth as well. So yeah, I am, I'm really, I don't know why I'm bent, but kind of, yeah. But I'm really, I'm really looking forward to this 24 day journey. I read somewhere it takes 21 days to build a habit. So if I can like, Try to reflect on my life at least 10 minutes minimum a day for the next 24 days i think it will help in the long run meaning i will kind of have cultivated a habit and then self-reflection always helps with growth you know how to check yourself you know how to you know tweak this tweak that and all of that so yeah i really 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 look forward to the remaining 22 days and um, I hope you enjoy my journey as much as I am enjoying my own journey because 2017 has been a roller coaster for me. I have made massive changes, I have done a lot of holding up friends, I changed my friends, I when I say friends, let me let me let me not use the word loosely. Like I have had a lot of experiences, like life experiences. I, I have grown, I have matured, I have cried, I laughed, I had just ignored situations and I had ha I've had to take painful decisions like 2017 I have grown, I can't even say 2017 was a waste but I have really grown and I grew so much from experiences and trust me, trust me I have learned a lot. So yeah I want 2018 to be a year of growth, I don't want it to be growing based on silly mistakes per se. I want to grow and then I want to grow based on the you know corrections I have made from the rising up of this year's falling down you know building on that foundation yeah I want serious growth and self-improvement and I want it for everyone as well so I think a little bit of reflection once in a while wouldn't hurt anyone you see what I'm saying so yeah, I'm gonna go eat soup to my stomach because I'm really hungry and I'm rambling on. So yeah. Bye. Hi, good morning. It's the 21, I guess. Yeah, no, 20, 20, 22, 22, 22, 22. And I'm a bit late because I was gonna rush up to follow a friend. But um, it is a very nice look of what I look like. Push my database. Anyways, hi guys. So I'm sure it's obvious we're not in my house. Today is my friend's birthday for Kylie and we are taking the night out and we're trying to use it to mark the end of the year, kind of, you know, it's been a long, long eight weeks. Yes, so today is day 22 and today I learned to be selfless. The whole of today I have been eating, but I use the whole day to run around for people, literally. Whilst not ignoring my own needs though, except my stomach needs. But yeah, so today I basically went for class, looking like a snack. I put some pictures up. My hair is dressed really now, how about I bought truth is I already put my clothes out for the week, so yeah. Then I I, I try to incorporate this, my hands are hurting guys, I'm not used to vlogging on the go. So yeah, I try to incorporate this mentorship thing into the International Association and true being told, it kicked off like on Saturday and um, it was a success to be fair. 
and I'm happy about it. So I went to see my mentees and they were really happy to have a child with me and I'm really hoping for the best. Like I hope we have a very, very awesome run and year together. Yes, you meet them as time goes on. Then from there I rushed off to a Jinsa meeting. Yeah, meeting with the ex schools and the president had tied me down literally and then we did some work. I'm talking to my camera. So yeah, we did some work for the association and I'm also supposed to do some other work which I have forgotten to do. I have to sit down with my phone. My phone is like on 4%. I have to make sure my phone is charged for the night. Then you know, spruce up this baby. You're going out. Woo, woo. So yeah, we're going out, yeah. And um, yeah guys, that's about it really. So today, I learned to be selfless. Yesterday, what did I learn to be? Selfless. Selfless, yeah. Actually, let's think about it. Yesterday, I learned to make myself available, right? So what happened? I was on the ward and this man really needed to get his sample taken. And there was really no doctor or house officer or resident on the floor. So the nurse then came to meet me like, okay, so please, can you help us take this sample? And I was like, ah, well, my first clinical year, I'm not supposed to do this thing. But I just said, okay, you know what? Because I really wasn't exact. I was not sure if I was, it was in my place to do it. Even if I could do it anyways. So I went ahead and I did it. And the relative was so happy. The man himself was so happy. I kind of got some fulfillment from it. So yeah. I think that's being selfless too. No, I think being relevant, yeah. So I really learned to like go out of my way for people. And then when the house officer came this morning, he was so excited. Ah, thank you, thank you, thank you. And then you see, you see, something I did right. So guys, um, I'll leave you off here to dress up. I'll show you pictures of my night out. I really cannot vlog because I do not have the light thing to vlog at in the evening, like the mobile one. So unfortunately, no, no vlogging on my night out. I'm sorry about that, but yeah. My hands are hurting, guys, and I'm hungry, so let me steal some food for my friend. Bye. Let me bring my implements of design out. Alright, guys, we are off. Lighting yeah. is this is the best light we can use. Our Uber driver has been really hey, nice. Hey, I'm hey, on I'm, on the, I'm vlogging. Our Uber driver has been really nice to us, so hello. He's been taking our pictures mm. and all, so but yeah. Thank you. How the are light, you? light is not cool, but yeah. Bye bye. You still listen.